Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Aoife, it's nice to meet you. So today I have a super exciting video. It's one that I've actually wanted to film and had to film for quite some time, but I didn't have time, wasn't motivated. I just had a lot of reasons. I had like other priorities to do. But this is, uh, as you can see, I have a full face of makeup on except my eyeballs and lipstick. And that is because we are gonna be trying out the one, the only, the Sosu collaboration with um, Kaylee, I think her name is. I have no idea how to pronounce it. It's like a big bunch of letters. It's a very Irish name. But this is the Urban Bible palette. It is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to be giving you my first impressions of this palette. So as I'm holding upside down so the mirror is here. But it comes with, it's a nice travel size kind of palette. It's not too big, it's not too small, but you've got all your colours and it opens up, it's like a cardboard kind of packaging with a magnet it opens up and you have a full size mirror which is very very nice and it has, you know, the logo and stuff on it and then it has your, I was gonna say 12 shades of colour but there's more, there's 16 yeah, they all have kind of funky names like 19 60, um, Unruly, Freyth, Aurora, Veil, Saviour, Mary, there's SM, I think, there's Freedom, Myth, all kinds of different names. They're very unique and there's, this is supposed to be like an extremely, extremely good palette, so I'm super excited to test this out. Um, I personally got this palette because I was obsessed with this YouTuber, I'll have her channel and stuff linked down below, but um, I'm obsessed with this YouTuber and I really wanted to test this out so I am very very cute. It also has a very cute detail uh, at the back. It's kind of cute and like personalised a little bit. I really love it. So today I have all my makeup done um, just so it would save time and I have no idea what kind of look I'm using. I really really love this yellow but I think I'm gonna go away later so I have a crazy highlight by the way. I tested that out and I'm not a fan of it but um I have no idea what I'm kind of going for in this look. I really love these kind of brownie shades. I love this shade here. And I'm really loving this kind of pinky shade and the dark purple. But I have no idea what I'm going to do. I'm kind of like letting it speak to me and stuff. I really love the orangey and the yellow shade. But I don't think I'll do that today. But I don't know. Maybe I could go with like a little brown and a bit of this. Or like a bit of dark purple. We're not sure, but we're just gonna dive right into it. So the lipsticks that I'm gonna be pairing with it, just so you kind of have a view, is the, what is it called again? Velvet Teddy by MAC. So it's kind of, you can kind of see where I have to like match it up. And I'm gonna be popping some of the, uh, what is this brand? Stay Pouch, Saintly. This is, oh no, this is a 17 lipstick and it's kind of like a lighter shade um, and it's called Saintly and I'm going to be popping that in the middle just to kind of like brighten the shade up. But um, that's kind of what I'm going with with the colours so I think I'm going to stay away from like the orange and the yellow and the green today. But um, yeah, I feel like this colour, this colour and this colour is kind of speaking, me to speaking to me today so I'm super excited. So the first brush that we're going to go in with is the Bank Canvas Cosmetics E32 brush. This is my absolute favourite brush. I cannot comprehend how much I love this brush. It's amazing. And we're going to be pretty much, yeah. I have my base and everything set. So we're going to be going in with Saviour. So it's this shade right on top. This better not have any fallout because I'll be real pissed. I'm going to have to use the mirror on here because I have a mirror in there but this one is just kind of easier to hold. It's like the perfect size for, I don't know, for the palette. I love how it's like a big mirror because having a small mirror on a palette really makes it very annoying. Also, I am very very sorry about my crazy highlight. I have no idea. I tried to take it off but it's not working so we're just gonna have to deal with it I've always tried to love this highlight but like it's just too purpley or something like there's something about it it's too like glittery and fake looking 
that I'm just, I keep trying to love it because it was so much money, but it's just, I don't, I can't love it. I just can't do it. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I just can't love the palette. I mean, I can't love the highlighter. So I'm gonna try and bring this up kind of pretty high. And we're gonna be doing the same on the other side. I'm so excited to like, I don't know, sit down and kind of film this video because I bought this months ago. I'm like, not even joking, I probably bought this like two and a half months ago and I have not even touched it yet because I've been waiting to film this first impressions and I really want to, everyone's talking about it and I'm just, I have it in my wardrobe, not my wardrobe, I have it in my cupboard and stuff and I just haven't even touched it because I've been waiting to film this video. So that is kind of suckish. I also have plans after I'm done this video and I'm not sure if I should keep this makeup on or if I should take it off because I really really hate the highlight. Like I really really hate the highlight. The next colour we're going to be going in, in, in with is this colour here. I think it's called like proper poverty or I have no idea. But I'm just going to be adding this onto the outside of it just to like kind of like darken it up a little bit. I'm not going to be doing a crazy look, um, I'm just literally going to be doing a basic look that's like super easy and maybe in the next few weeks coming we can do some extra looks. I'm so excited because I'll have more free time because um, today is actually my first day of not having two jobs so I am, um, it's a bank holiday today. Um, and today, yesterday, last night, was um, my last night in working in the shop that I worked in since I was like, I don't know, what age was I? I was in fifth year, so I was 17. So first impressions, I got a flat brush and I dug it into this. And it's like extremely, there is a lot of fallout that just fell onto my pants. Um, there was no fallout with the... I just scraped it off and tapped it to tap off the excess and it completely like tapped off the brush. It's literally just falling off the brush. I'm not sure if you've seen that. This time it kind of stayed on a little bit. That kind of scares me a little bit because... I really really hate fallout and my face is already glittery enough but it's like extremely falling out I'm like not sure at all if you can see that but as soon as I touch it it's like crumbling I'm not impressed It is a super pretty colour, but it is kind of like falling everywhere. Um, and it's kind of like a chunky consistency, which I'm not liking. Um, maybe you're supposed to use like a spray or something, but I'm gonna pretend that I like never heard of this person's palette and using it like this. Um, because, yeah, the colour is very pretty, but like I've tapped it into it and you can literally just see how it's like all crumbling apart. The two other colours that I've tried have com been completely perfect with no fallout whatsoever. And just the black in the palette is so black, like it's actually unbelievable. I'm not going to use this brush again because it just didn't work out for me and I'm going to be going in with the first shade that I used, the light brown, and I'm going to be like dusting it under. I have glitter all over my cheek now. So I think that's all we're kind of going to do um, for 
So I think that's all I'm kind of going to do for this look just because I'm going out in public and I have like so much fallout on my face. I really, really love the colours of this palette. Uh, it's very, very pretty. I think while I put a little bit of yellow, I think I might do that. I'm going to get the yellow shade and I'm going to dab it into this brush here, tap off the excess and we're just going to like tap it in here just to add a little bit of pop of colour. That's like somewhat cute but somewhat not cute but we good. Now I'm going to be going in with the lipstick and we're just going to be popping that on. So the lipstick is kind of drying in which is sound but um, I am going to be popping on some mascara. The mascara I'm going to be using is Too Faced Born Better Than Sex. I was going to say Born This Way. Like where did I get that from? That's the foundation isn't it? I think so. So we're going to be popping on a little bit of mascara. So guys this is the end of the video thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this quick little video about how i experienced the palette how i loved it i think i do love it i think i'm going to use um a spray like a setting spray kind of on the eye brush on the eye brush on the brush before i apply the eyeshadow just to see how it works but i'll be doing some crazy looks hopefully in the future with this palette and i feel like we're gonna be best friends so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you soon with a brand new video